Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel and local learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICC Mathematics Class 8 Chapter 20 Construction of Quadrilaterals Exercise 20A Question Number 1 and this is the second part of the question. So, over here, what have we got here? Let's have a look. It says, construct a quadrilateral PQRS in which PQ is equal to 3.5 cm QR is equal to 5.5 cm, RS is equal to 4.5 cm and your PS is equal to 5 cm and PR is equal to 7 cm. So PR is the diagonal and rest all these other measurements they are your sides. So again 4 sides plus 1 diagonal question right. Here I am on the left hand side I have got the rough figure with me. You can see we have PQRS and all the sides I have labeled along with the diagonal that is your PR. So first step we are going to begin really quickly without wasting any time. So we are going to begin and we are going to use the ruler first right. In the ruler what we will do is see uh, this is your ruler ok. Let me drop a new one this is going to become a, an older one right. So this is your ruler and what we are going to do with this ruler is see I will take the ruler I will keep it here and you can see PQ is of how much how many centimeters 3.5 centimeters so we are also gonna just draw PQ of your 3.5 centimeters here so you can just uh, give me a second you can grab your pencil and on the ruler just draw 3.5 like that right uh, 3.5 so it might become a little less or it might also become a little more it completely uh, happen here but make sure when you are making the figure it does not happen and measurements are accurate. So we've got here 3.5 with us now what we're going to do next is you can see that uh, this I label in this point this is your point P this is one is your point Q and this is of 3.5 centimeters right my writing might not be that great but try to understand so this is 3.5 we're going to keep the compass now we will bring in the compass now you're going to use this compass C first keep the compass at point P okay so this is my compass and I'll be keeping my compass here at point P right like that now at point P what I'm going to do is let me readjust this thing right uh, this one it looks better like this right so at point P what I'm going to be doing is you can see we have PS and we also have PR so two two sides we have here right PS and PR PR is the diagonal right so PR is of 7 centimeters so what I'm going to do is I will take this and open my compass up to 7 centimeters right 7 centimeters it's opened we are going to cut an arc over here just like that and now keep your uh, compass at same point P and now take 5 centimeters on your compass ok 5 like that or maybe a little less that should be fine so 5 we have and again same thing we will cut an arc here also make sure this is completely visible and I am just gonna cut an arc over here like that right that should be fine now we are our work at this point is done what am I gonna do next is uh, I'm gonna keep my Q okay this Q at your this compass at point Q and open the compass to 5.5 why because I'm going to be drawing QR QR is of 5.5 you can see in red color it's there 5.5 centimeters so we will open the compass to the length of 5.5 like that right that should be fine 5.5 now we have 5.5 and I'm gonna cut an arc here okay like that we've cut the arc and now we will join this thing see you're going to join from point Q to over here okay let's use the ruler instead that should be a better option right so we're gonna take the ruler keep it keep it at point P and move this thing to join this point this point that is formed after intersection this point we will name the point as your point R okay so this is here point R right 
I'm going to join this thing now so like that it's done now we're going to keep your ruler again and now this time I'm going to keep the ruler at point Q right and at this point point Q what again I'm going to do is I'm going to keep this thing and the same intersection this point that is here right this point we'll bring the ruler up here and we will join this right see like that and a little bit here right let's quickly join these things and let's move on to the next step that is what we're going to do is we're going to bring our compass out once again now you can label this point for your convenience this i'll call as my point r right i'll use a thicker labeling for this one so this is my point R okay right now we have this point R and what I'm going to do as is now that I'm going to keep my compass here at this same point like that you can see I've kept it and I'm going to open this thing to 4.5 because you can see that SR is equal to how much 4.5 the length of SR is 4.5 centimeters so we will open your compass to 4.5 over here just like that that should be fine right 4.5 and let's cut the arc again I've cut the arc and now we are going to be joining these two points this point that is formed is your point s and now we will join these two like that using your ruler itself keep the ruler at point p like that and now at s we will take this thing here okay that should be fine uh, let's do it a little bit more here right and we're gonna just join these two right like that it's done this is your formed word ps okay ps and uh, this it is of five centimeters right and now join this s and your r okay so let's see this thing we have here keep the compass at point S, bring this thing down to your R and join it together like that that's it and our work is again done you can also do the labeling it's very important to do the labeling so do, don't forget to do that this P S is of 5 centimeters right 5 centimeters your P R that is of how much seven centimeters okay so PR is of seven centimeters and your SR that we have just now made this is of 4.5 right wait a second so we have SR this is your 4.5 centimeters and the last one that's your QR that's of 5.5 centimeters right that's it our fair figure is also main right and friends this is all for today if you are new to my youtube channel do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one till then take good care of yourselves and bye bye